All right, so I have nice clean hands now. Um, my table is all clean that I'm gonna work on here as well. And you're gonna need a couple things for this activity. Uh, first thing is, is you need four placeholders. Um, I use paper plates, but you could also use regular plates. You could use um, pieces of paper. You could use post-it notes. Just something where you can see with what you're putting on top. A bowl could work, but you would have to like kind of lean over and be able to see what was in the bowl. The other thing that you're going to need is um, some kind of food object that's small, that will easily fit on your plate, um, and that you could hopefully snack on when you're done. I chose goldfish crackers here, um, and you're going to need eight of them. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If you don't have goldfish crackers, no big deal. Um, you could use cereal. Cheerios would totally work. You could use um, fruit snacks, you could use raisins, you could use pretzel sticks, pretty much any kind of food at all that would be uh, not too mushy, so you don't want to go into the refrigerator, it might be kind of hard, um, and something that your grown-up is okay with you eating when you're done. So you probably don't want to take eight apples because that's an awful lot to eat when you're done, but your grown-up can help you. So what we're going to do today, and um, Mrs. Velasquez and Mrs. Nagy's classes, you have a little bit of um, a heads up on this. If I show you one goldfish, you're going to say, ta, try it, ta, 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 ta. However, if I show you two goldfish, you're going to say, ti, ti, try it, ti, 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 ti. So I'm going to go ahead and show you something, either one for ta or two for ti, ti, and go ahead and say the right thing. Here we go. What's that one? Yep, that's a ta. Okay, how about this? Yep, that's T T. So hopefully that makes sense by now. And then you have your four plates. And each of your four plates, you are going to pick either one or two goldfish or whatever food you chose to put on your plate. So I'm going to start by having one fish on every plate. So one, one, one. One, and then starting over here on my left, just like you do when you read words, I'm gonna say the ta's. I'm gonna point to each goldfish. Ta, 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 ta. Then for my next one, I'm gonna put two goldfish on each plate. So I've got two, two, and two. And this time, since all of them have two, they're all gonna be a tt. So let's try it. T t t t t t t t. This time I'm gonna make a pattern. I'm gonna do one goldfish and two goldfish, one goldfish and two goldfish. So let's do our ta ti ti on this pattern. Ta ti ti ta ti ti. Now it's your turn to make up whatever kind you want. You've got four plates, you've got eight um, pieces of food, and what you need to do is for each plate, pick either one or two pieces of food to put on it, and then start on the left and read out loud, what did you write for music? You can totally play this with your brothers and sisters or your, or your parents. Um, you go ahead and set up some sort of music thing for them to read, and they're going to have to go through and read the Taz and TTs, but then give them a turn. Have them put the different foods on the plates, and if you see one, say Ta, and if you see two, say TT. If you want to get crazy with this, do eight plates and 16 goldfish or whatever um, little things you did. And you can do them in two rows and you can go through the first row and then through the second row. If um, your mom or dad has uh, a cell phone or a, a Chromebook or something like that and they can take a video of you trying this, you are more than welcome to send it to me. You can email it to me, um, but you don't have to. It's just if you wanna show what you've been working on. And then at the very, very end when you're all done, got your fish or whatever else you ate, have a snap. Bye, guys. Have fun.